So you now know that your own stock portfolio is as safe as an index fund. But does it also give you all the upside of an index fund? Actually, index funds don't give you all the upside of the entire market because index funds are not what you think they are. I'll give you an example. The largest index worldwide, the Standard & Poor's 500 in the United States, is only a limited reflection of the US economy. If you look at the mix of industries in the Standard & Poor's 500, it's very different from the mix of industries in the real US economy. And other indexes in other countries are even worse. Because an index is not the entire market, an index fund can't give you the upside of the entire market. Second, indexes are weighted by company size. That makes them even more concentrated than the true economy. If technology is in favor, they're concentrated towards technology stocks. If financials are in favor, they're concentrated towards financial stocks. That's against your interest because fashionable industries typically come back down to earth, leaving you with lower returns. In fact, this weighting of index funds is mainly done because it's easier to make financial products out of them, not because it better represents the economy or increases your returns. Since index funds don't give you all the upside of the entire market, they are the same as your own diversified buy and hold stock portfolio. And that's the key point to remember. Whether you pick stocks or pick an index or pick a group of indexes, you always make a choice. You never buy the entire market. But that's okay, because ahead of time, you don't know which parts of the market will do best. Because nobody knows, index funds and your own stock portfolio are the same in terms of upside potential. So remember, in terms of upside, a buy and hold stock portfolio is neither better nor worse than an index fund because indexes don't really represent the entire market for two reasons. First, the mix of industries in the index fund is different from the real market. And second, the weighting of the stocks doesn't represent the true market either. Since you don't know what part of the market has the most upside, picking your own stocks has the same upside potential as a stock index fund.